Hey everyone, welcome back to Daughters of Ash. Um, I think I said I would go back to the bonfire, right? Yeah, I did. I'm going to be honest with you. I 100% fucking forgot. Wait, what is this hole then? What? Wait a second. I don't remember this being here. Rhythm rune? Excuse? Is that what's gonna be happening? Rhythm rune. Oh, I have a firekeeper, so I should use that. Actually. Where the fuck is that? Or oh, they're like... Resonates with special weapon. Huh. There is like... I heard about this, that there is like a separate upgrade path called Runic in this game. Oh, I fuck, I'm out of Homeward Bones. Yeah. Okay, so here is the deal. That was cool, mainly because I didn't know that was a thing. Uh, but we gotta go get to Manus. Listen. Here's the dealio. Mm. I'll go back. I'll talk to Chester, maybe he sells Homeward Bones. Because, like, no motherfucker has sold Homeward Bones so far. Shit, I'm already yawning. Uh, it's probably because it's like insanely hot. The typical weather here this year that it will go from being extremely cloudy and fairly cold to insanely hot and humid in the span of like a day. Um, <clears throat> So anyways, I'm recording this pretty late at night. Uh, I'll be off on holiday tomorrow. Vacation. Yeah, we were just talking about this on stream. That I should just pick one. Vacation or holiday. I should go... Oh, you know what? Fucking... I set my Outlook. You know, that goodbye message in Outlook that you set. I should fucking change that to vacation. <laughs> yes, I think I'll do that after I'm done because I'm going tomorrow uh, and listen There aren't gonna be as many videos throughout the week as I hoped. I'm going to be honest with you uh, This has been one of the most insane weeks at work in a long time that I've had It's just how you know it came about that there was like a lot of things that kind of just were needed, you know, so I worked a lot and I didn't have time uh, to like, you know, fully prepare in pre-recording. So unfortunately, unfortunately, that's going to be something we'll just have to deal with. Um, it's not ideal, but I'll get as many videos out as I possibly can. Okay, why am I pressing? Okay, whatever. I already... The thing that I'm happy about is that I... At least finished the strength build for Dark Souls 3. Because that was like my main thing to finish that. Because... I think I'm gonna go with this one. I'm fairly sure this is the closer bonfire to Manus. Plus, there's less enemies to deal with. Yeah, I'm happy I at least finished the game. Fuck. I kindled this thing already, didn't I? Whatever. Yeah, I did. Does it also give you... Did I seriously just give me more HP? Or am I stoned? I think I'm not stoned. Well, that was interesting to try it out just for that, you know. So we got Manny to kill. The question is, do I have any weapon buffs? I do. I feel like we'll need to maximize damage. This fast as fuck elevator. See, because in the like vanilla game... 
this is probably not faster because the bonfire is located further beyond, you know. I just gotta get used to this path. So I'm pretty sure it's backtracking. Actually, I don't know, because the thing that is annoying about going from the cell is this guy. And this way you can just kill this guy. And just not even have to deal with her. It's actually a she, I think. Yeah, this... Okay. Mental note. This is the better path. Oh man, this boss fight is gonna be some shit. Although, to be fair, I did just beat two insanely hard bosses back to back in the past two days. Uh, who were uh, Sister Freed and what's his name? Gale. I'm, f I'm fairly certain both of those bosses are way more difficult than this guy. I have the silver pendant, do I? The question is, does it do the same thing? I didn't equip it because I'm stupid. I haven't seen this cutscene in so long. It's pretty cool. This is a well-designed boss. I like I like this boss. Okay. That is disappointing damage. Fuck. Okay. Here's the deal. I gotta readjust the Dark Souls 1. Fuck, where is it? Listen. It's all good. The key is not to panic. Okay, it does it. Cool. That's all I wanted to know. I thought it would. I mean... I was like, it's unlikely that they changed this, man. Yeah. Slow heals in this game. I got caught. I'm dead. Yeah, I'm super dead. Man, that was one of the worst Manus fights ever. <sighs> this HP the HP reduction. HP instead it said like Stewie. Now see the question is, does this reduce you to Yes it does. Of course it does. Uh I thought it would give you some leeway. But of course not. So yeah. That to say that didn't go exactly as planned would be an understatement. I think he's super resistant to lightning. Uh, he's super resistant to everything. But whatever, we'll figure it out. Uh, he can actually be poisoned. I think. Or am I just confusing him with Gale? I don't know. Who knows, who knows. Yeah, well, I have a feeling that the most of this episode is gonna be spent on this dude. Man, it's like typical of me, right? That I'm stuck like with back-to-back -back insanely hard bosses. Because, I mean, he's hard, like Manus is hard, of course. Not on Freed and Gale levels, but... For this game, he's hard, and the HP reduction and shit in this game, this version of the game, is, you know, just extra spice. Oh fuck, seriously? Are you kidding me? I'm not even gonna- I'm dead. No, I'm not. And he never goes for that. Okay, I think fire is better. Fuck you! Come on! Ah, It's such a... I hate that attack. <sighs> Ooh, 
We're doing okay, only 10 minutes in. I was thinking of cutting the... the rum bag, but it's like... It's actually not that long. It's just I'm dying a lot. Man! Oh wait, that's the wrong... That's the wrong thing. This is the right thing. Fast as fuck elevator. Ma'am, can't believe I go I'm gonna be gone tomorrow. Um, so happy to be going because I think I talked about this maybe just on stream, but uh, I haven't had like a proper go away holiday vacation. I gotta get into the habit. American Mercan. Um, I haven't had like a proper vacation outside of like a few days I took off because like we were dealing with COVID, you know, and all that shit. And after that, well, I mean, there's no after that. After that is when I'm going here. So hey, if you follow me, by the way, if you don't follow me on Insta, Mr. Underscore Sketchhead, uh, I'll be posting a shit ton of pics. People like the OGs who were around last year. Uh, not that OG, but you know what I mean. When I was in Slovenia, people were... People like that. And listen, I'm only going to humble Hungary, traveling within the country, but still. I think I should just go for the R2s. Yeah. Because like, cause the counter damage... Man, I wish I had the Leo ring. Was I? What the hell? Fuck. I'm pretty sure I wasn't on that. Mmm. Mmm. Tasty. The pendant though. At least with the pendant, you can just kind of spam it. Uh, the game doesn't really... It's its not really that picky. Um, how you time it. You just gotta be fast. He started using the magic quickly. Now listen, this is what I'm gonna check now. I'm not gonna buff my weapon, because I'm just wasting all my weapon buffs. And I'm gonna check how much less damage I deal. Because I have a theory that it's not going to be very much. I see, the thing that's just difficult about this is that uh, you always have a lot more HP for Manus. Which again, you know, this mechanic, this, I do like this mechanic, the HP loss, because, you know, classic, classics, classics, classic Dark Souls 1 issue is that there is no reason to technically there's no reason to ever be in human form i mean if you're not going for the npc invasions or summoning or pvp like why would you ever turn yourself human it's completely pointless you know and that's always been like the thing with this game uh which i guess they introduced because yeah okay I guess a lot of people complain and shit about Demon Souls and its HP mechanic. Seriously? Okay. Yeah, fuck me up game, please.
Too early. I mean, yeah, too early, yeah. I was thinking which one it was. Yep. Fuck. Okay. Stay <laughs> Stay cool. Fuck. Oh, no. Ah. Uh, I was getting up and I didn't have time to activate it. Shit. Shit, shit, shit. He feels more difficult. I don't know what it is. It's he's not. Uh the DLC bosses were unchanged. I have a plus fifteen weapon too. God damn it. God damn it. Am I ever gonna use power within? I doubt it. I should. I don't know if I have the lead skills to do this with power within. Well this is gonna be this episode, I think. As in, not, a, not that I'm ending it, but I feel like this episode is going to be Manus focused. Which, I don't really have any other choice but to go forward, you know. It's all good. We'll live. Oh, I got a humanity. Oh. It's so tempting to go back, but I'm too lazy. You know how it is. I'm playing, I'm really playing with fire here. I like literally. Go bitch. Now, so this should add, okay. Speaking of significant buffs. Man, power within is so good. I do like me some power within. Forget how good this thing is. I say as I completely whiff on Manus twice in a row. Lasts for a long time. What the hell? Did you see that? Man, there's some weird shit going on. Oh, that counter. Heal. I think... Did it wear off? No, not yet, I think. I might be fucked. What? <laughs> What was that damage? What was that damage? Seriously. Why does that deal so much damage? Um, still. Power within is the key. I realized. And I got pretty lucky with his attack pattern. He, got, he kept doing all his stupid attacks. Man! That's all I can say. You get the fuck out of here, charcoal pine. What was that damage? See, this is when you, listen, the cold wet finger of Dark Souls is probing your asshole. That's what's happening. Why am I losing HP? Or why did I lose it? Did I fell off? Did I fell off? Grammar. Did I fall off of something? I think I did. I must have. 
like slipped off slipped off the edge that was so unfair and this game is cruel you know it doesn't fuck around hey you're doing well on manas I think I'm gonna decide that this attack is gonna take uh, ninety percent of your HP. You're absolutely fucked if you don't watch out for that attack. That that attack is crazy. Not just because of the insane damage, but there's literally if you're close to him, there is like actually nothing you can do to get out of the way. Fuck you. Ugh. Fuck, I'm dead. He missed. He missed one of the attacks. I think I... Did I just get insanely lucky? I think I did. Fuck you and your magic. Fuck you and your eyebrows. Should've healed. And I'm dead. <sighs> it's nothing better than a instant wipe attack. I think I have one more try for this episode. That attack is like, listen, how many times have I died to him? Five, six? This is the sixth attempt, maybe? And. All of them have been that attack. I think you can um, maybe block it. No, but I, I remember like this doesn't matter. This is not a Daughters of Ash thing. Like, that's not it. It's a Manus thing. If you get hit by the t attack, you are fucked completely. And you know, like, you watch out for it, but sometimes. Like, you saw what happened there. He jumped. Uh, I got hit. As I was standing up, he was already going into the attack. So sometimes it's just like the circumstances uh, do not work out. I don't even know what happened. Like, this is still just the DLC, right? Mm. But I think you do need to come here in this in this version of the game. Specifically, if I remember correctly, somebody said that the uh, Covenant of Artorius Ring, which is needed for four kings, is here. Fuck you, Manus. You deserve that. So good. Power within is so good. Okay. Got greedy. See there. Okay. See that's okay. I'm gonna top myself off because I'm scared. Okay, thank fuck he went for that.
the... I think I'm gonna end it here. Yeah, that's it for this episode. Um, I've never felt more fucked over by this game. Goodbye.